Okay, on top of the roof now, I just finished closing it up, just doing my roof inspection. So these are terracotta tiles obviously, um, you can see the, uh, the bedding and the pointing has got a bit of mould on it, and so does the tile, um, but that's fairly normal for terracotta tiles, um, they get this type of green mould on it, it's very hard to get off actually. Um, uh, and that, so, But this bedding and pointing looks like it's okay, it's still pretty solid. Um, no cracks in it uh, and if I go over the other side of the roof just being careful where I walk yeah that's a toilet flue I'm just looking for broken tiles I didn't see any from inside the roof but but sometimes you'll see a broken one on top of the roof um, and here's a boomerang there you go genuine genuine Aboriginal boomerang that one all right uh, uh, yeah, just checking along. You see, they've they've had a little little leak here before, and they've put a bit of flashing under that and put that all back together. Um, foxtail dish. So that's all looking pretty good. The flashings aren't cracked. The tiles aren't cracked. And a little bit of paint off on the fascia here, um, but obviously. Uh, that, that timber there is exposed, so that timber is going to start to rot and, uh, and that because the paint's uh, not protecting it anymore. And then, of course, they'll need to put a new fascia on them, um, uh, fascia board if they uh, leave it like that. And you can see this, this timber down here starting to rot as well, so I'll let the owner know about that stuff. Um, they've obviously had a, a broken tile here at some stage uh, or, or something, somebody's you know dodged up. And, put some, some rubbish in okay. um, which is fairly common to see that type of thing but it's probably not leaking at the moment I didn't see anything inside that said it, had, said it was leaking so all right so that's pretty much my roof inspection done um, let's come over here the guttering looks fairly clean uh, there's a little bit of rubbish in, in that one there and a bit of rubbish up the end there. Other than that, it's all looking pretty good. So that's one more house cooler. Uh, comfort zones cooling Queensland down one house at a time.